What's going on you guys? How's it going? And welcome to the very first episode of the Taco Taste Test. I am super, 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 super excited to be able to do this. I don't know how many times I said super. <laughs> but um, congratulations to um, Nintendo Addict for coming up with the name um, the Taco Taste Tester. Oh, the Taco Taste Test is... <laughs> I'm already changing it. I'm having some issues where I can't hear, but we're good now. We're good. Um, so today, as you can see, we are going to be testing out uh, Banjo-Kazooie for the N64. It is on an actual N64, guys. I've never played this game. I'm super excited to, to try it out. Um, I hope you guys are excited as I am. Let's go ahead and get started. Um, yeah, I'm, I, I'm really, really excited. That's all I can say. So... How this works is basically I'm going to be playing the game for about mm, 30 minutes to an hour. Um, I'm going to try it out, give it a whirl, see what I think. Um, I'm going to rate it by 10 tacos from anything higher, higher than six will be something that I'm probably going to be streaming for you, my audience. Um, I also have help from uh some sponsors if you want to be part of this re live recording um just join the sponsorship it is either a you go to uh patreon.com backslash spanish dude and you pledge you can pledge dollar you can pledge two dollars three dollars whatever you feel more comfortable with and that'll give you access to discord where's where i put my link up so you guys can see this live and sponsors also get to um to join the ranking so i also take in consideration what the sponsors rank this game um and if you do not want to do patreon you can also join uh the membership on youtube by pushing the little button there that says join and yeah you can definitely definitely join that way so yeah guys let's get this started i'm super stoked let's do this i've never played banjo kazooie i'm really excited to join uh, All right, here we go. So it looks like his sister gets kidnapped, and it's up to us to go find her. Listen up. Okay, so this young man here, this, this mole looks like he's gonna be Fox better than you can. <laughs> okay. The ugly witch Gratilda swooped down out of the sky and grabbed her. Calm down, Geeky. Go get her back. Where'd she go? She flew up to her mountain. There. It's really dangerous. So you'll probably need some training before you go up there. Press A if you want me to teach you some basics. Okay, so he's gonna be teaching us all the moves. Oh, good. If we speed it up, it'll be good. <laughs> there we go. You went home? Hello again. Let's start with the camera. Oh, like every other game, the C buttons will be doing the camera motion. Hmm, your jump can do some. More than you, press A. More than you. Press A to jump and hold it. Jump higher. Come on, brothers. Give him a hand. I'll look silly. Jump and press A again in the air for a double jump. <laughs> That's it. We're ready to move on. Not until you learn this one. You must stand like this. What? 
wearing ridiculous glasses and silly <laughs> and silly grin. I think so. Empress A for gift. Ooh, backflip. What are the oh, okay? Are they like honeycomb? An extra honeycomb to like six increase your energy. Okay. See if we can get going up, let's go. Nice. Okay, we got a light. Hey, Banjo, I hope you're not afraid of heights. I'm not. Tell me about flying. Oh, not yet, Banjo. Jump onto the tree. Use a control stick. Climb up and down. So far... The game control is really nice. It reminds me a lot of um, Conquer, and it has better handling than um, than Donkey Kong Country. That needs an old chicken leg. At least I got some le legs. I see and press B for a power. Ah. Another one. And it's time for you. I guess for, for Banjo's attack, because I haven't attacked anything yet. Okay, let's find something. A challenge. <laughs> it's a giant carrot. <laughs> Alright, let's attack the dangerous carrot. Is that a giant onion? Oh. Nice. Did we get this one? Maybe. Fancy learning to swim underwater. Okay, this is what we want to learn. Wasn't it? No, I've never played this. Okay, the the swimming's a little flimsy. The, sw the swimming's a little flimsy. Well done, guys. We're ready for we're ready to tackle the witch now. You're out. Show us the way, bottle boy. 
fix the bridge so you can cross it. Enter it with the hug. There you are. Go from the inside. Good luck. That means my tricks. See who wins. Oh, well then. Okay. Alright, well, we are in the lair now. Hey, it's me, Mr. Piggy. Now go and find a picture with a piece missing. You fix the picture in... Into the picture on the picture filled missing pieces. At the first jigsaw. Great, to fill in the missing pieces on a picture, press A. If you don't want to use any jigsaw pieces, press B. That's it. The picture is complete. And the door to Mumbles Mountain is open. Okay, so we don't go through the picture. Okay. I thought we had to jump into the picture. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so this is probably the first world. Here we go. There are three moves to learn in this world. Find my mole hills, and I'll explain. I'm a note one of a hundred of each world. Collect us to open the note door. So I get the feeling that it's kind of like, um, kind of like spiral feeling, you know, where you want to collect everything. Oh, the swimming is terrible. this God. all right so let's see these have pictures of those oranges did he hit them with the orange okay so yeah that's what he's gonna do sweet never bear so we got that now. So are there more puzzle pieces or is it just one? What's this little monkey want? Chimpy hungry wants orange. Now feed Chimpy. fat bear what a rude little monkey <laughs> camera angles are kind of hard I probably gonna have to throw the eggs to learn the buzzer to learn an ancient something or other i missed the, what it said Listen. hold z and press c button to shoot an egg out your mouth sounds cool anything else sure press the bottom instead and you can shoot them from behind <laughs> So I get to poop him out then. <laughs> Eat them. 
What are those for? The mumbo token used for mumbo magic. Is that the skeleton looking guy? So, so far, I'm kind of enjoying this game. No, I fell again. You know what they feel like? The controls feel like they're heavy. Like the character is heavy. Does that make sense? Oh, bear beak. Kanga. Dun, 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 dun. Like it feels like I'm not gonna jump very far. <laughs> I definitely like the art style of this game. I call this a break buster jump. Jump into the air and press Z. Slams hard down the floor. I don't like the sound of that. Get used to it, nest girl. You'll be using it a lot. Oh jeez. So jump and Z. Oh, that <laughs> looks so painful. <laughs> the poor bird. We got another one. Nice. Da, 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 da. What's your story? The juju mumbles totem pole. Feed us nice blue something. Eggs? Eggs. Eggs. Nice. What do we get? Me, my best shaman in all game. And help Banjo. And filthy feathered one. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic token. Hid, hid by witch. Find tokens. Banjo not good enough to not not got enough tokens for mumble magic because signs bringing more So we need five we have three we're missing two more okay Sounds useful. How does she do it? Hold Z, then press C button. Left C button. So I got a couple of things to say about this game. Other than the camera being weird, um, the controls being a little uh, wonky, nothing major. Just when I mean wonky, I mean it just feels like Banjo weighs a ton. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> grab the puzzle piece. <laughs> so what's in here? Hey, ugly, no bears allowed in. There's one more up there. Okay, so we got five. Uh, On skull and press B. Oh, well then. I'm a ant? Magic free change back. Ready. Termite. I'm a termite. <laughs> Give me that cool backpack or else. Yo, these are mean termites, man. Uh. 
<laughs> okay, okay, we're up, we're up, we're up, we're up, we're up. Oh, there's more letters up here, good. Nice, we need a couple more letters. More chicken eggs. That's the secret of life. There was another puzzle piece, I thought so. Okay, let's go here. Jump! Let's go! Up! Up! Boom. Oh my, just weak, turning back. Okay, cool. You open the world door. Bad is escaped. What's oh okay, note door? This is a note door. Feel very friendly with one of her powerful magic spells. Open it up then. Not that simple. To open it, you must collect musical notes from the world. How many do we need? The number on the door is the strength of the spell. Find total of all your best note scores from the world. You must be at least this to break. I have a hundred. Not bad. Oh, right there. Oh, we have eleven. Wait, so can I take them out after I build them? Is that a thing? Better trove code. No, okay, so once they're in, right? Okay, okay. Sweet. All right, guys. Well, there we have it. We got to try Banjo Kazooie. Um, so here are my thoughts. My only issue is the camera and the controls. They feel funny. Um, they just feel heavy. But I've been saying that the whole stream. Um, the whole video I've been saying that. So, other than it being heavy, feeling like heavy, the game itself is actually really fun. You want to collect everything in the world. It kind of it kind of gives you that, you know, oh, wow, let me finish collecting the notes. The notes I have 50. I can get 100. Um... It, you want to collect all the, the magical head things because, again, you want to know what the shaman is going to do for you. And then the puzzle pieces are just like, well, the more I have, the better, right? So, <laughs> um, other than that, the game feels good. Uh, I really, 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 really enjoyed it. So, I think out of 10 tacos, I'm going to give this game possibly... I'm going to give it an 8. Just because of the camera angles and the, and the, and the controls. But I'm gonna give it an eight out of eight tacos out of ten. Um, what do my sponsors give the game after watching it and how I played and everything? What would you guys rate this game? So there you have it, guys. Everybody gives it an eight out of ten tacos as well. Well, guys, that is it. That is it for the first episode of the Taco Taste Test. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. I cannot wait for more. And to get going on this a little bit more in the future. I'm super stoked. I really enjoyed it. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. 
Thank you all for joining me today. Super, super awesome. I love you all. I'll see you all. And don't forget the most important thing in the whole wide world. Come to my live stream. I'm super famous. Take care, guys. Have a good one. Bye.